this lesson we're going to be looking at how we can add images. So we're going to be adding a web image into our Google Sheet. So one is going to be a method that you can just add the image directly within your Google Sheet. So this is going to be a specific location, but it's not actually going to be within the cell. If you do want to have it within this type of format where the images are sitting within the cell, then there's another set of code that you can do, and that's going to be using the cell, the new cell image method. And we're also going to be using the same image URL in both examples. Create a brand new spreadsheet or open an existing spreadsheet. And what we're going to be doing is we're going to be adding an image, so a web image into this sheet. And this can be done using Google Apps Script. So go ahead and select the sheet ID. Or if you're using a bound script, you can just use the active sheet as well. So this is going to be selecting the sheet and what we're going to be just call it image adder so that's going to be the function that we're going to be running and then what we want to do is we want to select the sheet object so we can select the google spreadsheet using the spreadsheet app and then open by id and then specifying the id value of the sheet and then in order to actually access the spreadsheet where we want to insert the image in so this one's just number five sheet number five and we'll just rename it to my so we want to use the sheet object and then get sheet by name. And then we use the string value of the name of the sheet that we just created or that we want to access. So let's select a range. And this is gonna be selecting the cell that we wanna insert the image into. Select the sheet and then get the range. And the range can have just the one value and that's gonna be the one cell that we wanna insert it in. And just using the notation for the cell, which is going to be A1. So it's going to insert in the first cell. And now we want to get the image. So this is a web image. So we've got an image URL. And I do have a web image that I can use. So on one of my websites, paste in the path to the image. And now in order to get the image as a usable object, we're going to use the URL fetch app. And then the fetch service for the fetch app and use the image URL that we just passed. And we want to return that back as a blob. So that will give us a usable image item. We can log that out in the console just to make sure that everything is good with the code. So we've got it within a blob format. And once it's within a blob format, then we can get the sheet and we can insert the image using the insert image method and then the image itself, which is in a blob format. And then let's go back into the sheet. So let's try to insert it in one, one. So that's the row and the column that we're inserting it in. And so this isn't going to be an inline image that's going to be inserted into the document in this location. So let's see where that happens. And when we run it, there's the file, but it's not attached within the cell itself. Let's do it again. We'll do another one where we'll do within the row and column 2020 and save that. So we'll insert it again and we'll see that now it's going to be inserting the image in that particular row and column. So there's the row and column, but it's still not an inline image. It's still floating image that we can drag and position. So it's not actually within the cell. So in order to uh, insert it directly within the cell, you can insert the image into the cell using the new cell image method. So I'll show you how to add that one in. And this is going to require a few other parameters. So just copy and paste, and we'll call this one uh, image adder cell, because this is going to be going right into the cell. So we're going to have to select the range in this case, and the range can be and we'll just select the range at one, one. That's gonna be the range that we're gonna be inserting. Uh, so we're gonna also still be using the image path. We've got the image URL that we can insert directly via the image URL. So we don't even have to use the fetch as well. And then we're not using the insert image. And so this part is gonna be where it's different, where we're gonna be inserting the image and sending the value within the range of the image. So create the image that we want to use. 
And this is using the spreadsheet app and then creating a new cell image. We want to set the source URL of the image. And this is where we can use the image URL that we just have. So it's gonna be adding in the source. And you can also set the text title. So this is the title of the image. And because this is chained, can be chained together. So it's an object that can be chained together. So this way it's a little bit more readable. So we've set the text title. And then once we've set all of the values, then we're ready to build the image. And then lastly, we just select the range and then set the value. And the value that we're setting is gonna be that image that we brought in and save that. So run the code. And there's our image that we inserted just in that first range. We can also have it span on a larger range as well. So now we're adding it into all of the cells within the range. And so this is different than what we were doing with the other function when we're just running the cell adder is that that was adding in the image that wasn't necessarily tied to the cell, whereas these ones are tied to the cell. And as we make the cell larger, the image also will resize in its dimensions. So that's how you can add an image into your spreadsheet and also how you can add an image specifically into a specific cell within your Google Apps Script. And I'll just clean up the code there. And go ahead and try it out for yourself. And this is number two different ways to get the images into your sheet.